everyone, Alexa Dunn here, and today I am letting you know about Write On Con, which is an online kid lit writers conference that is happening February 8th to February 10th, in which I am participating. Write On Con is one of my favorite writers resources. It was really helpful to me back in 2013 and 2014 when I was working on my first novel and querying it, and I've been delighted to participate in it for the last few years as an agented and to be published and published author. So many people I know have found critique partners through Write On Con, found their agents through Write On Con, and the best thing about it is that you don't have to leave your home to attend, you don't even have to wear pants if you want to technically, and it is super, super, super affordable. Write On Con is all about accessibility. It's meant to be affordable, easily accessible, and jam-packed with information to help aspiring writers get to where they want to be. The conference portion all takes place on writeoncon.org, and registration starts at just $5. It caps out, I believe, at like $25, which is like a high level that gives you access to archive posts and lets you like look at this year's conference a bit longer, but for that $5 registration, you get tons, and for $10, just a little bit more, you get even more. There are live pitch events you can participate in with really great agents. There are live Q&As and panels with agents, authors, etc. Just, it is jam-packed with really good information and resources. As with last year, I am attending as an official guest. So I'm going to be on a live panel, I'm doing a podcast, and I'm doing a video, ooh, and a couple of roundtables. My agent is also participating, which is super exciting. We're both big fans of Write On Con, going way back from before she was even my agent. And then in addition to the paid conference side, there is also free forums. The forums are honestly one of my favorite parts of Write On Con, and they are open as of February 1st. On the forums, you can post your query, your first pages, any questions you have about writing and publishing, and the Write On Con community is super supportive and active. You're gonna get feedback, you might connect with critique partners, and they have agents and editors who go through and anonymously leave comments on queries and first pages during Write On Con, so you might get valuable feedback from a publishing professional. Now a little bit more about the sessions I'm going to be doing this year. The schedule was just posted and I'm going to link you to it down below so you can find not only my sessions but everyone else's. There are some really good topics this year that I am also really excited to watch and read myself. But the things that I'm doing. I'm doing a podcast on all the writer feels, so all of the crazy emotions, the ups and downs that we go through as writers. It should be a good discussion of things like jealousy, imposter syndrome, the, the extreme happiness, and like, oh, the extreme lows. FOMO, we talk a bit about FOMO. Just all of the possible writer feels you might have. I'm also doing a vlog on YouTube for authors. This one isn't going to be too surprising and possibly not super new information for a lot of you if you are literally watching this video right now because, well, we're here on AuthorTube, aren't we? But so many authors, especially in the traditional publishing space, are afraid of YouTube. And so I did a little video just kind of explaining why YouTube is such a potentially valuable platform to authors, why they shouldn't be afraid of it, and some practical tips on how to get started. I'm also participating in a roundtable on critique partners. So this one's going to be a blog post where I think there's like eight or nine different authors and they asked us questions about finding critique partners, working with critique partners, and all of our answers are going to be in the blog post. So you're going to get lots of different perspectives on this really key topic. People ask me all the time about critique partners and it's just such a valuable relationship. And in fact, Novelty also just did a show on critique partners, so I am going to link to that down below. And then I am doing a live panel on Sunday night about marketing, marketing for authors. It's a live thing where you can ask questions about marketing, so I don't even really know what to expect, except we're gonna have a good conversation about like, what does it mean to do marketing as an author? Like, how much can you expect to do versus your publisher, etc., so on and so forth. So I'm really looking forward to that because you know I love talking about marketing. And actually, I haven't talked about marketing too much on this channel lately, so that's kind of a fun thing that you're gonna exclusively get over at Write On Con, and I will be joined on that panel by Kosuko Jackson and Sarah Rosh. So it should be a really good live panel discussion. So that's it, that's me 
giving my pitch for Write on Con, why I think it's great, why I think it's totally worth signing up for, or even if you don't attend the conference, definitely check out those free forums. Write on Con also recently launched a free critique partner match up program, and I'm gonna link to that down below, lots of links down below. If you're looking for a critique partner, I do recommend you check it out. Let me know down below in the comments if you have any questions at all, or if you're attending Write on Con, if I'm basically gonna see you there. And if you're not already subscribed to the channel, go ahead and do that. I post new videos two to three times a week. Thank you so much for watching. I hope to see many of you at Write on Con. And as always, guys, happy writing.